good morning today i want to talk to you about the food and beverage which we need to avoid if we want to have a good and healthy pregnancy so first of all guys or girls uh, pregnant ladies try to avoid alcohol why guys because alcohol can make the baby depending on alcohol and as well alcohol can cause miscarriages or still bars so be careful when you're drinking of course if you're drinking a little bit wine that's that will be fine but if you're drinking too much that's not good for your fetus also guys what you need to avoid this is ham why guys because ham is a very tasty feeling for sandwiches but they um contain they contain one bacteria which can cause listeria and can promote high risk in listeria so be careful when you're eating ham instead of eating ham you can put in your sandwich tin of tuna or something like that just to fill your sandwich also guys salami is not good for you then they also can lead to listeria risk and also they contain lots of saturated fats which are not good for you uh, also what you need to avoid is a raw meat if you like to eat pork steaks or beef steaks or any steaks try to make them more well done that means um, cook it properly if you're not cooking properly inside they may contain uh, again uh, bacteria which can cause listeria and can harm you and can harm your baby so make sure you're cooking your uh, meat properly also what, what guys is not good for you is to eat organ meats although organ meats contain lots of iron vitamin b12 they contain copper they contain uh, they contain uh, as well high vitamin a they are not very good during the pregnancy because they can cause toxicity uh, uh, because of vitamin a and because of the copper so try to avoid organ uh, meats like kidney heart or uh, liver black liver or something like that try to avoid it because they can cause um, high levels of vitamin a also try not to take fish oil supplements which are also high in vitamin a and also uh, too much too many supplements try to avoid too too much intake of supplements at all try to get uh, the vitamins minerals by your food not by uh, supplements uh, also guys what is not good for you this is pate pate is very tasty but also contain uh, inside in pate there is a liver and that means the pate contains lots of vitamin a and uh, as i said uh, these uh, high doses of vitamin a can uh, damage your fetus so be careful and try to avoid it during the pregnancy after pregnancy after you deliver your precious child you can eat everything also guys what you need to avoid um, or uh, what you need to do is when you're buying chicken nuggets or uh, chicken bread steaks um, uh, these kind of things try to cook them um, very uh, good uh, try to cook them properly um, put more time over to, uh, in their cooking because if you're not cooking them well they might contain um, bacteria and that can le uh, lead again to uh, listeria which is not good neither for you neither for your fetus inside also what uh, many doctors are not recommending is the cheeses brie and the, the blue vein cheese because they also contain bacteria and only if you're cooking them properly well done cooked you can use them also some doctors are not recommending ricotta and what they're saying that ricotta can contain some bacteria so uh, if you're not cooking the ricotta properly try to switch the ricotta with the soft cottage cheese if you like it in your sandwiches or like that um, also doctors are not recommending soft serve ice creams what they recommend guys is uh, to switch the ice cream with yogurt why because uh, soft uh, serve ice creams contain uh, 
milk, unpasteurized milk or maybe eggs or something which can cause infection in you and you don't want that. Also guys, what you need to do is to avoid eating too much dates. If you're eating one, two dates a day, that's fine. But if you're eating too much, they can heat up your body and can lead to uterine, um, uh, uh, uterine um, um, miscarriage or um, so be careful when you're eating too much dates uh, also what the doctors are not recommending is papaya if you know uh, some ladies who don't like to be pregnant once they understood something like their um, their periods are are missed or are, are getting delayed they go and buy pineapple papaya tamarind why because these foods can actually promote miscarriages so if you don't want to miscarry your precious baby inside try to not eat tamarind uh, uh, too much tamarind too much papaya too much aloe vera i know aloe vera usually is uh, healthy uh, to eat to put over your skin to put over your scalp but when you're pregnant try to avoid it also guys uh, what uh, doctors are not recommending is to eat too much uh, foods containing sugar or sweeteners like a biscuit dessert cheesecakes ice creams and that kind of things they are recommending that you need to focus on the more nutritious food like a fruits and vegetables also when you're eating fruits and vegetables try to uh, um, wash them properly and store them in the fridge so they are not to not uh, get any bacteria uh, also try to avoid uh, raw fishes like a uh, shellfish um, like oysters and that kind of things if you like them cook them properly before you eat also if you like chill prawns like in salads and that kind of things when you're pregnant that is not good for you because they can promote bacteria and you can get some infection listeria and these kind of things so you don't want this if you like prawns try to steam them more uh, for more longer time and then consume them um, also guys uh, what uh, um, uh, doctors are not recommending are uh, fish like a shark or uh, some other big fishes which contain lots of mercury and heavy metals this is not good for you and for your fetus also guys doctors are recommending not to eat too much mayonnaise because mayonnaise contains raw eggs and raw eggs can contain salmonella which can cause some infection in you and your baby and you might lose it so try to avoid uh, mayonnaise even if it's your favorite it's only uh, nine months uh, or eight months because you didn't know before you're pregnant so try to avoid foods which contain raw eggs and also do not eat undercooked eggs undercooked fish undercooked meats why because inside there is um bacteria and especially in uh, undercooked um uh, eggs and uh, there is uh, they can contain salmonella which can make you sick and your baby sick and we don't want that also what we need to do is not to take too much coffee caffeine drinks uh, during our pregnancy doctors are recommending around 200 milliliters that is around two one two cups per day of coffee or black tea or green tea if you don't know black tea and green tea contains caffeine also some uh, uh, soft drinks they contain caffeine so make sure uh, you are trying to avoid, uh, avoid them also doctors are not recommending uh, soft drinks which contains lots of sugar and sweeteners uh, and the diet uh, soft drinks so if you can stick more to uh, pasteurized milk and a uh, water if you like uh, juices uh, don't buy uh, juices which are uh, in the uh, stores but um please try to make a fruit juice in home uh, because the vitamins uh, when you're making it straight away are much more and uh, is fresher and it's not going to lead to bacteria i hope i was helpful uh, 
I hope uh, you like my video. If you like my video, please like it. If you want to see more videos from me, please subscribe to my channel. Um, also, take care of yourself and your uh, precious one. Um, uh, don't do too much exercise. Um, limit, uh, 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 limit the heavy liftings. Um, try to uh, eat more uh, nutritious and um, more beneficial food for you. Be happy, be positive. Bye-bye.